you own a DJI FPE drone and you've been practicing on the simulator and you feel it's the time now, the time has arrived for you to fly it in manual mode, then stay connected to this video. I'm going to show you three things. First thing, how to unlock it in your goggles. How much the return to unbutton is useful for an FPV drone. And the third thing I'm going to show you at the end of the video is something that happened to me that will probably happen to you if you fly outside of North America. Let's go. So the first thing you need to do, you need to uh, connect your battery to your goggles, uh, switch on your remote controller and switch on the drone. As I said before in previous videos, don't forget to remove the gimbal protection. Then put your goggles on. I'm going to show you where to browse in there to unlock that manual mode. So go to settings, control, remote controller, button customization, custom mode, and manual mode. Select manual mode. The second thing you need to do is go back to settings, control, remote controller. Go to gain and expo and at the bottom deactivate the ham mode added to limits. So there you are. You are in manual mode now. So let me explain to you the way I behave, you know, when I fly this drone. I'll be honest with you, I'm able to take off. I mean, I'm able to do it in a simulator, you know, I'll, I'll just take off in manual mode. But with this DJI FPV drone, uh, I tend to take off with the normal mode. Then I switch to sport mode and then I activate the manual mode. So when you activate the manual mode, uh, I won't be able to show it to you now because I don't have no action cam when you press that M button what happens is you need to like in the goggles it will show you where you are supposed to position your joysticks so please do so and there you are you are in manual mode enjoy and stay connected until the end of the video because I'm going to show you what happened so the weird things that happened to me was that I've set the flight distance limit to 400 meters I live in Europe, sorry for all other zones, folks. I've set it to 400 meters, and what happened to me is that mm, between 300 and 400 meters, I lost the connection with the drone. I mean, it's weird, the goggles were not connected to the drone anymore, and it's like the signal I had in the goggles just froze. So, what I did is I pressed that RTH button, the return to home button. Honestly, I was a little bit worried because it was the first time that I was in the position to use that RTH button but it did the job I'm not going to say that I rely on it 100 person but it can save your drone question what happened I know that this DJI FPV drone is able to do what we call long range you know it's able to go like miles away so what happened this is what we're going to talk about in the next video okay come on I'll tell you the next video I'm going to talk about what we call the FCC hack because I fly in Europe this drone does not behave the same way on each continent so we'll talk about it in the next video FCC hack please subscribe to this channel cheers <laughs>